Hi everyone, today we're going to be reviewing Paw Patrol Mission Paw Barking Bird Adventure Game. This is a game our son received for his birthday, which was about six months ago, and ever since he's always loved it. The quality of the board game is pretty good, it's pretty decent. I'm, not, I'm usually not a fan of Paw Patrol products or merchandise, but this one definitely is holding up. We've been playing it for hours a day and it's still all in good condition. The board is really small though, uh, which I was kind of disappointed about, but it doesn't make or break the game. Um, the age it's recommended for is four years and up, but I totally think that a three-year-old is fine. That My son got it for his third birthday and he loves it. Um, as long as the child isn't mouthy because it's like cardboard pieces, I think they're fine. It comes with six of the Paw Patrol original characters and then there's also Ryder who is a plastic statue our figure that our son likes to play with but I'm not sure if he's actually supposed to play so the concept of the game is fairly simple we've played um, a way that I'm not sure if we just kind of made up but it's similar to candy lid where you spin a color and you move to that color you get a chip for the color that you spin that all have icons on them so if you land on a spot that has the icon you get to make the jump and if you don't have the the chip you do not get to make the jump. This game can take anywhere from like two minutes to five minutes. I don't think we've ever played a five minute game unless there's a break. Um, it's super fun, it's super simple. I absolutely recommend this game for kids. And the fact that it takes such a short amount of time, it's really easy to find the time to play this game. Sometimes we'll play if we have a little extra time before school. We'll play instead of reading a book at night, we'll play the game once or twice. It's been a really good learning experience for our son how to win and how to lose um, it doesn't take much skill it's all based on luck so it's not like he's always going to win by default there's always a variation of outcomes no matter how skilled you are um, everybody's a fair player totally love it you can find it at Toys R Us like I said it's about $12.99 totally worth it so one of my only criticisms about this game, aside from the board being so small, it kind of goes hand in hand with that, is the spaces are really small. So when you play with multiple players um, and you all land on one color, it kind of becomes a mess. All the, the pieces will fall. So I think that if it was a bigger board, it would be much easier to play. But it's really not that big of a problem. Just a minor thing. So if you guys have any questions, leave a comment below. If you liked the video, please leave a like and feel free to subscribe.